Welcome problem solving fans to another problem of the day and this one is about a right angle triangle inside a circle. C is the centre of the circle and we're being asked to find what is the area of the triangle. Now what we should know is that the, the area of a triangle is found when you multiply the base by the height of the triangle and then divide all of that by 2. Now this height of the triangle there's a posh word that goes in there, and that is the perpendicular height, which we'll talk about in a second. So, we need the base and the height of the triangle. So, the base is nice and easy. That's the line across the bottom of the triangle. So, the base of this triangle is 7, and the perpendicular height, well, perpendicular means the, the height that is straight up from the base the triangle at right angles to the base of the triangle. So the height of the triangle makes a right angle with the base. That's what perpendicular means, makes a right angle with the base. So the question is, what is the height of this triangle? What is the value of this line? Now, there doesn't appear to be any numbers written on it, but because it is a circle and this cross is the centre of the circle, what we should know is that from the centre of the circle to the outside, that is the radius. Now, as long as you're in the centre of the circle, you can draw a line from the centre of the circle in any direction, whether it's down there or across there or across there or across there. As long as you go from the centre of the circle to the outside, then every single time it is a radius of the circle. And the radius of the circle does not change whichever direction you do it in. It's not like an oval where the distance across the centre like that would be a lot longer than the distance up to the top from the centre. With a circle, the distance in any direction from the centre to the outside is the same. So what this means is that the line going up from the base of the triangle to the top of the triangle must also be a radius. So this distance in red here is also a radius of the triangle. And if the radius is 7 along the bottom, the radius is 7 up the side. So the height of that triangle is also 7. So we need to do 7 times 7 and then divide it by 2. Well, 7 times 7 is 49, so we need to do 49 divided by 2. So 49 divided by 2, the easiest way to do it is to do 48 divided by 2. Well, 48 divided by 2 is 24. And the extra 1 divided by 2 would give us 0 0.5, because a whole 1 divided by 2 is 0 0.5. So it's going to be 24.5 centimetres squared. And that's your final answer, 24.5 centimetres squared.